can I just say that this is one of my least favorite menus of all time? This is... This is disgusting. And, oh, can I just also say that when this starts... I, I wasn't recording it, but I wish I was, because this opens up and it's the loudest sound I've ever heard in my life. I had my headphones on and I was sort of messing around with my microphone I was waiting for the game to load. And it just makes like the most hideous, loud noise that I've ever heard in a game. So, if that's any indication of what this game is about, it's gonna be pretty exciting. So I'm sorry I really haven't been uploading any content to this channel lately. I'm gonna get back into the groove, hopefully soon. Um, I've been making animations and stuff and kind of been focusing more on that So if you guys haven't seen my cartoons, they're over on Dungeon Your Cartoons And I've also been streaming over on Twitch where I've been playing Hollow Knight and Warframe and a whole bunch of cool stuff So if you guys would like to see that, go check out my Twitch in the description So let's just jump right into this Carrion If I uh, know anything about this game Apparently you're an angry meatball An angry meatball who just is mad at the world for some reason. Oh, I'm breaking loose. Little meatball, go. Um, <laughs> oh, why is everyone screaming? Is there a monster? I gotta get out of here. <laughs> why is everyone freaking out? Oh God, this is, that's some good tentacle animation if I do say so myself. So people in my Twitch stream uh, suggested that I play this because I was asking people for what to play. I wasn't really sure. Oh, these people are crying. Oh, I feel bad. Am I the bad guy? Oh, no. I'm gonna have to... Oh, I feel terrible. Oh, my God. Don't run from the meatball. I'm just... I, I know my appearance is scary, but... I'm just looking for friends. Wow, this is a... This is a weird game. How's everyone doing today? Uh-oh. They got the meat the meatball alarms going off. Yeah, people suggest that I play this. Can I go in the water? I can't. I'm an aquatic meatball. I'm gonna licorice whip my way around this this town. Uh aim with RS and hold RT to grab objects. Pull RS to interact with them. Uh where am I? Oh. <laughs> I can aim. Whoa. That's disgust. This is disgusting. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> That's like actually very satisfying. Huh. This is a interesting game. No one said anything about what this was. And uh, it's on the game pass and I kind of just looked at the thumbnails really quick. And you just looked like a really pissed off meatball with arms. This might have actually been an episode of Aqua Teen Hunger Force that I'm just forgetting about it. Uh, I can grab humans? Oh, I don't want to grab humans. Can I go through this without hurting anybody? Oh, they're like crying and everything. This is terrible. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. He's, no one wants to die in the, on the toilet. Oh, you should have stayed in there, man. You were much safer. Yeah, go in there. You don't need to see this. <laughs> Can I time it so he doesn't... Oh, I don't want to hurt these guys. I feel bad. Unless they're evil. Oh! I don't know how to control this game. I've got too many arms. I'm, I'm used to only having two. Oh! Get out of here! No! I don't mean to hurt you! I can't control my appendages! <laughs> I can't control myself! Oh my god, okay, catastrophe averted. I'm gonna try to get through this without hurting anybody. Unless they're jerks, unless they start shooting at me or something. So I can only... Okay, so I can only grab onto stuff if I actually aim with the right stick. Got it. So yeah, I started playing Hollow Knight uh, on my Twitch because I realized that that game is actually kind of hard to break up into uh, little segments. I also lost my data and that kind of bummed me out. Can I... Uh... Oh, there's a wall there. <laughs> Um, I lost my data for it and I had to start over, but it was actually for the best because there was a lot of stuff in that game that I missed, which is incredible. Because the second time playing it through, I realized, uh, get out of here! I can't control myself. What are you guys doing? Wanna hang out? I know I'm a meatball, but meatballs can have fun too. 
Don't worry, I'm not gonna kill. Consume humans to regain biomass and grow in size. Oh man, do I have to kill people? Oh, I don't wanna be the bad guy. Oh, I can just hang from the ceiling. Oh, this is gross. I'm just like a meatball wrapped in licorice. Sounds like we're disgusting. Grotesque, even. Oh, why couldn't they be like... How do I get through here? I'm gonna grab someone and accident and rip their torso off or something. Oh wait, do I go through here? Oh, I, I can't grab the door without grabbing you, dude. Or can I... Can I do like a... A ta- Oh, I knocked him down! Oh! I mean, if he's... I mean, that was partially his fault. Oh no, he's still alive. <laughs> oh, chill out. Wait, I never see a meatball before? I can't... I, I feel like I'm supposed to open this, aren't I? Right? Where do I go? Go this way? No, it's already over there. Oh man, I'm gonna have to kill people, aren't I? Oh, stop your crying. Wait, you don't like meatballs? Is he dead? He's not dead. I just want to open the door, sir. There we go. <laughs> See, no one was harmed in the making of Meatball Mania, or whatever this is called. Carrion. <laughs> That's what it's called. But yeah, I was playing through Hollow Knight, and uh, I was doing it on stream, and man, there was so much stuff that I missed. It, it's, it's crazy. That's a huge game. I, uh... <gasps> I opened it. See, you don't have to hurt anybody in this game. I'm a friendly meatball, not a mean meatball. What does LT do? Oh, my meatball tummy's grumbling. Oh, quit your whining. Have you ever been to Olive Garden? You didn't order the meatball with licorice? This control's so smooth. It's a little, like, weird, though. But I, I like how... What's that called? Procedural animation? Where it, it latches onto things? I think that's called procedural animation. Spread biomass and save? I don't want to spread anything if I can help it. Ooh. This kind of reminds me of a prototype. Oh, whoa, what is that? Oh, what is that? Is that me? Or did I leave that? Oh, that's me. Oh, God. Oh, no, that's not me. Oh. I just left a, a mouth. This is intense. Interesting. Squeeze in. <laughs> no, thank you. Oh, I didn't. <laughs> I don't work here, so I can't get in here. I'm not registered yet, I guess. They didn't put the meatball on the menu. I'm outside the frontier wastelands. Beach your way to safety. What is this? Seals breached 100%. Biomass samples lost 50%. I don't know what that means, but apparently we, we breached 75%. That's a good. That's a good breach ratio. I'd like to have my my breach ratio high. So Hollow Knight on Twitch has been a lot of fun. Uh, if you guys would like to check that out, please do. The link is down below. It's on Dungeoneer Art and Twitch. And I think I've kind of decided that I'm going to continue playing that on on stream because it's kind of a longer game than I thought it was. Um, I thought Hollow Knight was kind of a shorter game for some reason. So I think from now on I'm probably gonna play. I'm gonna leave longer games for streams, and then shorter games um, are gonna. I'm gonna make those into let's plays. It just works better because I, I really don't want to have like episode 500 of Hollow Knight, you know? Because a lot of Hollow Knight's like backtracking, and uh, I there was definitely some bosses that I was having a really hard time with, and I had to fight them a million times. So that that kind of game I feel like just works better with uh, stream. But I will eventually. Uh, Maybe do some highlights or something like that, so you guys can see all the fun action. Because we've had some pretty good laughs with the Hollow Knight stream so far. Also, I've been playing Hitman. Hitman 2 is really fun. Woo! Look at me go. Who needs ladders? Ladders are for squares. I am a Meat Boy. This kind of reminds me of Super Meat Boy. So I'm hoping this game is, like, shorter. I probably should have looked that up. Uh... Yeah, who needs this? Ah! <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna throw stuff around. Meatball throws metal simulator. Hopefully this game isn't like 70 hours long or something like that. Am I calling out to my other meatball brethren? Do I have like a, a slam attack or something? That looks oddly breakable. 
I guess I'll investigate that some other time. So if you guys have any games that you'd like to see me play, any like shorter games, um, please let me know in the comments and I'll, I'll check them out. Okay, okay, work with me, Meatball, work with me. There we go. I did it. I will beat this game without harming a single soul. Alright, so I can't go through there. I also really like the music. The music's very, like, ambient. Very calming. I'm a friendly meatball. They created me for doom and destruction, but that's not what I want from life. I want to be friends. I want to roam the valleys looking for other meatballs to befriend. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, neither do I. <laughs> Caution, unprotected mine shaft in this area. Well, at least they warned me first. Wait, can I pick this up? Ugh. Wow, it actually has like weight to it. Damn, this is a really cool. How have I never heard of this? I I think I got this game confused with that other game that kind of looks similar to this. I I think uh I think Game Grumps played it. It's the one where you're like you you do look like a meatball creature, but you have like two arms and you I think it's co-op and like one person controls one half. It's really gross. <laughs> I thought this was that game. So that's why I didn't want to play it at first. Cause I was just like, eh, just looks like something you might not be able to play solo. What is this? I feel like I can get down there. Can I squish through? My tentacles can get through. Why can't I get through? What if I grumble? The grumble do nothing. I thought the grumble would do something, but it did nothing. If you're one of the few people who doesn't know, I'm also an animator over on Dungeoneer Cartoons, which is my main channel. Squeeze in! Do I have to? Oh, even the chains move around. Um, over on Dungeoneer Cartoons, you guys can see my animations. Uh, most of them are Markiplier related, and recently I put out the Poppy Playtime one, and it's doing pretty good. I'm glad you guys like it. I had a lot of fun animating uh, Huggy Wuggy. What is going on here? God, I'm just spreading my meat across the land. Military junkyard. I feel like I'm missing things. Oh, this is mine now. I'll take this with me. <laughs> oh, I actually can't. Wow, that actually came with me between the screens. Unknown biological threat detected. Stay alert. Yeah, that sounds bad. I don't want anything to do with that. Boink. <laughs> I, I really like the way this thing moves around. Oh! I dropped it in. So currently I'm working on uh, Markiplier Animated Finance and Freddy's Security Breach. Um, I've only seen the first couple episodes of Mark's playthrough. And uh, my friend Jen also plays it too. And I like it. It looks pretty cool so far. I don't know if I'm going to play it because I, I feel like that's the kind of game... Oh! That guy's got a gun. I feel like that's the kind of game that you kind of need like your first impression with it and I, I've kind of already seen quite a bit of it so I, I doubt I'm gonna play that one I do want to play the other finance and phrase games though like the original ones um, but I think security breach I'm probably not gonna play just cuz I kind of already seen a lot of it so it wouldn't have like the same impact on me okay you sir have a gun I'm not gonna hurt you but if you shoot at me if you shoot my meatballness if your bullet penetrates my meatball, I'll be very upset. Or shoot everything that moves and does not appear human. Well, it looks like I need to figure out how to look more human-esque. Oh, I could even like... Wow. I mean, I don't really know much about coding video games, but like coding the tentacles for that, that is really... That is something. Especially for a 2D game, I would not expect it to have such a... Look at that. I wouldn't expect it to have such a... Complex movement thing like that. That is really cool. Oh no, I'm gonna have to kill... I'm gonna have to kill Dave over here with his handgun. Oh no, I'm trying to do the passive run. Maybe I can sneak past him. It looks like I can go under the water. I'm kind of getting a weird feeling that this game does give you... An option not to kill things, but I feel like at the same time this game might be <gasps> <laughs> You see nothing 
Go back to your business. You you don't need to die today. I'm sure you got a a human wife and human kids. Does he hear the door open? He does. <laughs> I love that. Peekaboo. Oh no! That kills me instantly? Oh man, I am not a very tough meatball. Alright, well you know what? If we were all in that position as Dave was, we would have all shot. If we saw a mass such as this barreling towards us, playing peekaboo with the door, uh, a meatball. You hear that? He can hear me. He can hear me whipping stuff around up here, whipping and naying up here. So I'm not gonna fault him for blowing us away. So now that I know I only have one health. Oh, into the sewers. Yeah, you kill that door. You show that door who's boss. Oh, I can't get through here. What? There's a little pipe. Oh no. Oh, I can knock him out. Do, 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 do. No, I didn't kill him, did I? Is he okay? He's fine. What a baby. Gets hit in the face with a door. <laughs> Saving the game and I'm spreading my mess. Spreading my meatball mess. Coming out of the spooky meatball. Doing the spooky meatball. Look at this. They got a bunch of old Apple, old Macs stacked up with chairs and things. Man, this is this mass spreading is pretty disgusting. What if I roar at this? Whoa, it reverberated. I wonder what the hell that's for. I wonder if I can like lure them, lure them to a certain spot or something. Or if I can confuse them. Why does everyone have guns now? Everyone's got cardigans and guns. Oh, he knows where I am. Uh, I think I have to go down. If he opens that door, he's gonna see something he he's never gonna forget. Wah! <laughs> no. Yes. I mean, they'll never find me. Huh? Can you shoot me in the water? I think he killed me. He didn't kill me. He thinks he killed me. What about this? Oh, I can't go that way. Oh, <gasps> why? That's some clear water that he saw me through. Alright, so if I whip the door at him, I can like knock him out. <laughs> oh no! No! Maybe he's okay. Maybe he'll <laughs> walk it off. Okay, well, let's pretend we didn't see that. I'll just cut that out. Wow, 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 wow. Oh, I, can, I actually can take a couple shots. I just have to be moving. These guys are mean. What the hell did I ever do? All I did was throw a door at your friend and cut him in half. That could have happened to anybody. Alright, now I gotta throw it a little bit gently. There we go. More gently, because this guy's a lightweight and can't take a door to the face. Can they see me? Oh, they can't see me. Man. <laughs> I obliterated him that time. <laughs> Alright, that he's not walking that off. Oh! <laughs> I'm too quick. Man, everyone's got guns. Can I scare him? Dig! Dig, you meatball! Yes! I will kill no one. Oh, man. Could you imagine if you saw that? Is anybody out here? Oh! <laughs> Ooh, what's this? Oh! Friend? Squeeze in. I will go back to my chamber from which I came. Am I about to get more radiated? Do DNA absorbed Ar arachno fights? Arachno pits? Shoot a cobweb to trap your victims or interact with objects. Ooh! Look at that! A Spider Man! Ew. 
Is it made out of popcorn? What is it? Why does it disintegrate like that? That's cool. So maybe that's like a non-violent way to to go through this thing. Can I trap this? No. Why does stuff go through this? It looks like I can get. Come on, <laughs> squeeze. You squeeze into the little canister. You can't squeeze through this. What a tease. Oh, I didn't even notice there was a lever there. I mean, I totally knew there was a lever there. I'm a pro gamer. The pros of gamers. All right, let's see how these humans like this. They don't like it. Humans don't like being shot with webs. All right, let's give this another shot. Not today. Oh, I, I grapple. Oh, why he can shoot on laying down? Oh, these guys are more advanced than I thought they were. So what happens when I retract the web? Oh my God, there's no, I'm at to start killing people. <laughs> I don't want to have to start hurting people, but if they keep shooting me in my meatball face, not really leaving me an option. So what happens when I... What, what does that do, exactly? It just kind of like knocks them down. Alright, lady. You, oh! I didn't mean to do that. Where'd the other guy go? Oh, he's still there. I suppose I shall consume. Oh, man. Oh, I'm a bigger meatball. Oh, no. Wait, I was already down here. I guess I'll save. <laughs> you know, I try. I just. Oh, wait, there's actually. I mean, since these people are dead. <laughs> since these people are dead, no one needs these legs. No one's using these legs. I see my meter up top is going up. What, is, what does that do? Interesting. Oh god, now I've turned into like a meatball burrito. Ew, ew. Oh, that is. This is nasty. Oh, it like re. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I thought it like reformed the meatball. I thought it turned me into more of a ball. Oh, now I'm more like a meat slug. Oh, this is nasty. So I can. I can shoot through. Oh, is I supposed to like creep up here and then go blah and grab him with that? I see. Oh, I can. That's gross. I feel like at some point I'm gonna be able to squeeze through there or something. Oh, hello. Yeah, I can grab through the vents. So what else do I do though? I can't reach him with my other thing. What if I let go? That don't do nothing. What is that? Is that hurting him? I can't tell if that's hurting him. I think I'm just kind of flipping him around. You can't see me up here. Did that kill him? I think that killed him. Or maybe she's just taking a nap. Or she's playing dead. Can they shoot? Oh, they can't shoot me. Oh, that's my health. Oh, man. Well, I guess... Wow, they, everyone's got like a nice pink card again. What am I at? A, a Hollister or something? <laughs> I thought you guys were scientists. Well, well, well. The shortest pacifist run ever. If a, ain't nobody gonna use this, I guess I'll take it for myself. Who's crying? All oh, these guys. I won't, okay, here, here's my rule. I won't kill anyone who doesn't have a gun. How about that? How's that sound? <laughs> 10 minutes later, I'm killing everybody. Oh, I got more tentacles. More meatballs equals more tentacles. Nah, yeah, I don't need that door anymore. Wait a minute. All right, I can't shoot through that. I feel like I'm, I feel like I'm flying through this really quick and I'm not like paying attention. Maybe mean, yeah, I do have to go this way. Anybody with a gun who wants to get eaten? What are these? 
Can I web that? I cannot. <laughs> so what's that about? What am I... Oh, I'm like opening the door with my tentacle mass. Ugh. This is nasty. I'm going to get you. You have a gun, therefore you must die. <laughs> that slingshot effect is really, really satisfying. I really like that. So what happens when I'm full health? Do I... Oh, God, I just turn into a... A bigger meatball sub from Subway. Ooh, a switch. Come on now. Alright, so now I can go up the elevator shaft. Oh, oh, oh. oh no, their colleagues' legs are gonna come flying through the ceiling. Oh, that's disturbing. Use LT to echolocate nearby hive crevices. Ew. Are the hive crevices like the things I haven't opened yet? Are the hive crevices the safe? I think this is a safe place. Hey guys, what's going on? How's work been? Lots of cool graphs and things. Let's see. Yeah, I wonder if those are ones. Alright guys, I'm just gonna go in here. I just gotta squeeze myself into this wall. It's gonna be really gross and you probably don't wanna watch, but if you wanna watch. <laughs> La da da, going into the wall with my meatball. Oh, don't come running towards. Oh, they did wanna see it. They came ran running towards me. They're like, I wanna see! Retrieve biomass. What does that mean? I can't get out. I'm too big. <laughs> I'm too thick. Uh, have I gone? Oh no, I haven't gone down there. Oh, calm down. It looks like there's no difference between the ones that I've already opened. All right, guys, I need to open this door, so you need to. Thank you. Sorry, I broke the door. <laughs> you can bill me for that. Send it to my meatball address. As soon as waste landfill. This is pretty colors. Don't think I can do anything with this yet, though. That's a downward tube. Can I squeeze myself in this tube? No. Uh, guessing I can't. I'm guessing at some point I get something to break those, so I'm just gonna go back up here, I suppose. So you guys wanna like go to Pizza Hut or? You guys are busy. Uh, I'll catch you later. Just because I'm a meatball doesn't mean I can't make friends. I think we're going this way. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, I can go up here now. I think there was something else I can open now that I have that web thing. So this is kind of like a... This is almost Metroidvania-ish. It seems kind of linear right now, but... It seems like a little open-ended. It's kind of cool. Squeeze in. I don't think I want to... Do I want to go that way? Uh, oh, this is the thing that I open. Squeeze right in. Military junkyard. I did it. Seals breached 50%. Biomass samples lost 100%. Containment unit locked. Don't know what that means. So... Is that trying to... Oh, wait, I can go this way. I wonder if... Is there a reason to, like, 100% stuff? Squeeze in. Let's investigate the area before we squeeze in. Caution. Unprotected mine shafts in this area. That is the least of your worries. So there's something really gross about me dunking my body into this water. Woo! Oh, am I uploading myself to YouTube? What's this? I'm going into the dream world. What the hell? Oh, I'm a little scientist. Oh, this is not nearly as exciting as being the meatball. Hold LT to run. 
What is this apocalyptic wasteland? Don't go down there. Is this like... Oh, I got a little... Oh, they got a little drone? That's like kind of 3D. I wonder if this game is like... Is this game technically 3D? Are these models actually pixel art? That's throwing me off. He looks 3D. I, mean, I guess you could do a 3D game with stuff. A? Eh? It won't budge. Is this like... Am I like seeing into the future? This appears to be Meatball. A patch of anti-Dilovian anti moss? Or... As Olive Guard would say, Meatball. It's part of, a, part of a high fiber meatball mesh that we designed in our lab. What did that do? Oh. This is really creepy. Kinda yeah, cool though. My uh, colleagues don't see him as eager to get down here as I do. Come on guys, there's nothing to be afraid of. I'm sure there's no giant meatball. Slinging around like Spider-Man. A disorganized mass of bone and dry tissue. Oh, God. Is this... Did I do this? <laughs> Did I do that? <laughs> am, am I the murderer? Examine. Plan C4? Oh, God. Why'd they take a picture of it? What are they doing? Why she hook herself to the C4? More of that meatball. Oh, an, un an unidentified species of tube effects worms? What are we, uh... Oh, it's the wire for it. <laughs> I was like, ah, uh, why is she uh, bungeeing herself to the C4? There we go, we're in. We're in, ladies and gentlemen. Come on, everybody. What's the worst that can happen? Interesting. Was I like some recovered creature from some other laboratory? Or is this the laboratory that they stumbled upon? Will this meatball only keep getting bigger? You've heard of Alice in Chains, so now it's Meatball in Chains. Epic joke. Leave that one in. That will get everyone to subscribe. <laughs> Alright, everybody. Well, that's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you guys did, please leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. And turn on those notifications. And uh, thank you for the people that suggested this to me. It seems really cool. So I'm excited to keep playing this. I don't think it's a really long game, so I should be able to get through it in a couple of episodes. Um, if you guys have any other videos that, or any other games you guys would like to see me play, please let me know in the comments. And uh, hopefully, like, more shorter games... Uh, nothing like, you know, 80 hours long or something like that. But, uh, yeah, and then maybe some horror games, too, because I really like horror games. Those are usually a little bit more entertaining. This is, like, a... I don't know. I was trying not to be the bad guy, but I had to kill people. Or maybe there is a way not to kill people. I don't know. But I really like it so far. I'm interested to see where this goes and what other, what other powers are... Our growing, our young growing meatball is gonna get. And if you haven't already, please check out my animations over at uh, Dungeon Cartoons. I almost forgot what it was called. <laughs> but go check them out. I hope you guys have a good day or good night, and I'll see you next time.